Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Blood Samurai. My name is Sam and you know I wasn't I every time I record a video like this with commentary, it's a bit risky. But this is a game created by Radiant Sloth. I've played his it's a, a game that he made, Destroy the Monolith. I love that game. He's a really cool guy. I love him as a as a game developer, as a person. Like he's just he's a really cool guy. Um, so, whoever's behind Radiant Sloth, whether it's a person or people, they're all great. They're great, it, the person's great, or the team's great, whatever. I'm rambling. Um, choose a captain for the next show. So we're just going to get into this, so this is another, like I said, this is another game that they created, Comet, uh, Comet Force. It's currently, um... It's on and it's in the playtest play um, stage right now on Steam. Um, search with the academy I already built. Choose a captain for the next run, Emmy. And yeah, you have a. Um, you know, I always like to go into these games kind of just not knowing what's going on. A hyperspace anomaly spawning hostile foes has been discovered in the galaxy. The Federation has tasked you to lead the Comet Force, an elite unit just dedicated to fighting, fighting the threat. Wow, I can't speak. Your mission is to construct your camp around the anomaly. Grow your troop, improve your gear, and eliminate each and every enemy wave. You must survive at all costs to keep the Comet Force alive and ensure the safety of humankind. Good luck. Oh, I'm gonna lose immediately. Um, dash. Okay. Okay. So what is this stuff? So okay. So you build. Okay. Okay. So this is obviously a resource. So you have gems up here to research new technologies. Does it heal the captain and troop members? Let's improve the strength of the captain in classes. I think we'll build, we'll put down a, a, so we have a command center, and we could, what did I do? Okay. And we have an academy. And then we have more building sites. Okay. So. Okay. 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 There's a lot of there's a lot of projectiles flying at me all at once. It's a little hard to. Okay. Oh my gosh, these guys have a lot more health than I thought they would. Like, there's so many of them in there, I'm still, I'm just really struggling. I mean, I'm pretty sure, actually, they, I don't even think I need to dash, they just can't hit me. Okay. So you, so, okay, okay, that's really nice that you can just, like, basically, you don't need to, you don't need to start the next wave. Wait, do I already have a training center? No, I have an academy. But it's specialized. Um, special effect of the, or a class of the troop. Uh, I would I would say the one thing that I would like for it to show would be. Oh, so you get options. More damage, reload, or health. Okay, yeah, definitely more damage. Okay. Definitely want to get more damage. Was there like a... a special attack or something? Other than the dash that I have? I don't think so. Either that or just, I just didn't see it. Or I just don't know what the button is for it. 
Those are all very possible things that could have occurred. Okay. So yeah, we're not gonna we're not gonna mess with that for now. I think I'm gonna recruit a guy. Um and then it will be we'll, this will be fine. Basically, the idea is, at least my plan, is create guys that are going to be as strong as possible, so you can have quantity over quality, because if you have quality, then your guy, or if you have, if you have quantity, it's going to cost more gems, because you're going to constantly have to, like, Basically, like, recruit new guys if your guys die. Uh, so. First into three more bullets when killing an enemy. Ooh, laser bullets bounce on their last hit. Travel back and forth. I think that would be good. Use and hit up to two more, two, up to two times. I like that, okay. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Cool, okay. I already, I have... I have a very good feeling about this game. This seems really cool. I'm not sure how balanced it is yet. Like, I don't know if the enemies are really weak. I don't know if the... I don't know if they're... Uh, it starts with the academy over the hill. What do I specialize in? This is knockback. Gives five more points for the same price. We get half of the new first troop number. Uh, I don't... I guess I'll go with that. I don't really like any of those things, to be honest with you. Okay, so yeah, so it does also... Okay. Get some more of these guys going. Gotta keep, keep training them, keep training them. We do a lot of knockback. Okay. Boss is a little feisty. Moves around a lot. Gotta be careful. I'm trying to stay close enough so that my mem my troop members can also attack. So we're not sat here for like a whole decade trying to kill this guy with, because of just my bullets alone. With how much health he has. Um. Okay. So, Technologies. Ooh, pressure. Charges and inflicts contact damage. 
approaches with the area. Ooh, cannon near, yes. That sounds sick. Oh, no. I can already tell things are gonna get very much so difficult. They have like, it's like, yeah, they can't, they can't really, ad like wraps. Like when things are, when they're kind of getting, like, they kind of just scurry. They kind of scurry. It's the best way I can like describe these little guys. I wish my guys had a little bit more maneuverability to them. I definitely think we're gonna need probably some healing. So I think it would be a good idea to build that. Okay. Okay, and you can only have we'll go with that then. How much does it cost to heal? I think I can push my guy. Most damaged. I don't. Well, I don't know. Uh, they don't have much health, or like they don't have. They haven't lost much health, I should say. So it might not actually be that worth it. To... I wish it would show in a number form how much health they have, so I could actually tell how much health that they have actually. Rather than just a bar. Honestly, if anything, I think I'm the one taking the most damage. I'm obviously not doing very well at not taking damage. So I'm assuming this number, yeah, that's the head count. Okay. After each wave fully heals the three most damaged members of the Oh, whoa. We're fully healing them. That is that's sick, yeah. That's so cool. Okay, I think I'm okay with that then. Probably get a couple of cannon years. Let's see. Uh, space mine will explode and flick a stronger, bigger explosion. Let's go with that. Here's what like a space mine would kind of looks like. Ah, have to lead your shots. Like the cannoneers are actually really nice because their shots are their projectiles are really quick. Yeah and that and that just damages or that, that uh, heals all of them which is so nice. Okay I don't think I need a new class. I feel like I just kind of need to keep kill, 
Uh, I have to drop one extra gem. Ooh, yes. More money. That'd be really good. Okay. Money is maxed out. Okay. Being hit generates a space mine. He turns in. Uh, honestly, maybe that. Just because, yeah. Because my guys are obviously being healed as well. So I feel like that could actually to have some of the damage be shifted onto them. Which obviously sounds like a bad thing to, to do as like the captain of a team. You're like basically like letting your guys take take the hits for you, but Technically, it's kind of beneficial. Nice. Okay. Not nice. I'm okay with this for now. But I think what I want to do is get some more candidates. Uh, I think I'd rather that because obviously I don't really. I don't want my guys dying, so it doesn't really make sense to invest in stuff that's only beneficial if my guys die. Okay, but now that I'm seeing it, um, my guys might start dying at a very rapid rate. Um, I want a new class. Maybe. Let, let's take a look at what some of the different classes there are. Current gunner spins and shoots laser bullets all around. Gets close to any attack from an explosion? See... These guys just all sound not great. Like, okay, I'm gonna hire you for my team. What can you do? And keep in mind, your enemy, they all have ranged units. What are you good at? I'm good at getting close to my enemies. But but they have but they have ranged They have ranged attacks. Yeah, I'm gonna get close to my enemies. But what if they shoot at you? 
not get close to my enemies. I can just move it. Oh, okay, yeah. We, we, um... Medic! <laughs> Medic! Thank you, medic. Oh, that was expensive. Should I? Oh, yeah. I should be improving improving their class. I forgot I can even do that. I mean, oh, okay, so I can dash twice. Oh, wow, that's actually really nice. I can basically just constantly dash. Okay, well, I can't constantly. Of course I can't constantly dash. It's literally just... It's just I wasn't in the thing. So that's why I was able to. Obviously, in the field, it's going to be a little bit different. Okay. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think we're going to need some more help emergency center. No. Uh. Oh, okay. Nice. That was pretty sick. That was a nice little like play test. That was really cool. Oh, I love the game so far. That was awesome. Um yeah, definitely check out Radiance Lost. Check out Comet Force on um, on Steam. This is this is such a cool game. I honestly would love for it to like continue. On. <laughs> this is so fun. Okay, well, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video of Comet Force. If you did, please leave a like on it and subscribe to the channel. Again, don't forget to, you know, show some love to Radiant Sloth. Definitely, you know, wishlist this game on Steam. It seems really cool, really fun. Um, and, um, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I hope to see you guys in the next one. You guys take care.